G'day, it's Pete here, and I'm back for a free day-long tournament. This is an eight-board BBO tournament that you can play by going competitive, and then free day-long tournament. So let's jump straight in, see what we can actually do. Pass, pass to me. I've got an 11 count. Um, I would always open this hand, usually. Uh, being a best hand tournament, um, considering not because I don't have the spades, but I love aces and kings, so let's just get in there and bid it. Uh, club two hearts double. Okay, so if I wanted to pass this, then I would need three defensive. Well, I've got three defensive tricks. I need my partner to show up with another one. So if my partner's got three tricks for me, then I can pass and beat this. Alternatively, I could just try and bid three clubs, which is probably taking the safe road. But I might just go down in it. Like, what do I need? Like, if my partner's got, say, Ace, King of Spades and the King of Diamonds, that'd be perfect cards for me. But I'll take... I'll, I'll play it safe. <laughs> um, okay. Our hearts are 6-0. I'm not sure we would have beaten two hearts, even though they've only got six of them. Um, diamond lead. So I got a diamond loser, two spade losers, and some club losers. We've got some heart losers as well. Uh, let's just cut communication by ducking the first one. Okay. All right. Uh, so what do we know about shape? Um, they hopped in with the king of spades. So what are my options here? I can rough this with the nine. I could play for clubs four nil. I could rough this with the ace of clubs and just play a club. Uh, Ace showed up with King Queen of Diamonds and the Ace of Spades, so the King of Clubs is offside. So let's try and prevent uh, any cross roughing. So just rough that with the Ace, let a club, and win that. Draw the last trump and down one. How will that go? Well, let's have a quick look. So, I guess if I pass West, would potentially just pass this hand in, which would do better. If I, like, they, what do they they make? He says seven four. Never took a bid. It's kind of unusual that they that they don't want to bid on this hand. Um, but, uh, like, passing the first one's fine. I might open a diamond. I might do something else. Then when your partner opens a week two and it goes double pass. All right. We would be entitled to one club trick, two hearts, a diamond, a spade. It looks like five tricks to me. I, I feel like they could probably make two hearts. So I'm... I think this... Like, going negative here is slightly bad. I reckon there's about 40% here. Um, also, even if I didn't rough with the ace, they had to follow, so that was all fine. So here we've got 6, 12, 14 points, balanced hand. Start with one club. Just rebid one no trump. Two no trump, invite. And I have a 4, triple, three, 13 count. Um, hmm. so 13's like not great for, like, no, 13 I usually accept on, that's what I'm trying to say. Here it's a 4 triple 3 so I'm going to take the low road, this is also match points, so let's pass, but uh, 3 no trumps could be on. 
heart lead. So we've got two diamonds, a club's three, two hearts is five. Uh, looks like working on spades is good. I might be able to get three spade tricks sometimes. You can also duck the opening heart late. Does that do anything? I reckon that's okay. It might cut communication a bit. Okay, spade and the king one. Um, ace shown up with the king of hearts and probably the ace of spades. Hmm. Okay, so I could play a spade hoping that uh, spades are 3-3. Three, three. And if they are, I'm probably home. I could also play like a club to the ace, club towards the 10, hoping east has that. I could come out the diamond hoping that diamonds are 3-3. Three, three. So, alright. Um... If East had Ace Third Spade, they could always hop up with the Ace of Spade second, the second time, uh, because their partner can't have like if they had Ace Third Spade, they know I've only got three spades, and their partner can't have uh, like a spade on a dropping. So with that information, East might hop up with the Ace of Spades with Ace Third. With ace-jack fourth, they would never do that because their partner might have queen doubleton spade. Although I might have queen doubleton spade and still might hop up. But I think I'd be more worried about... Oof. Hmm. Okay, also West has shown up with no points. I've shown up with a jack of hearts so far. I feel like playing for diamonds to be 3-3 three, three is the best odds, rather than the spades. Okay, that failed. Okay, spades and... Okay, ace-jack of spades, king of hearts, uh, queen of diamonds, so they're both offside. <laughs> Look at my five of clubs grow up. <laughs> um, but two no trumps, down one. So I could have made an over trick. I have to lead like low diamond towards the jack. So jack of hearts ducked, and now another heart. Okay, so at this stage, I have to lead the... Oh, there's nine, eight doubleton clubs. So I have to lead the queen... Like, take a double finesse hooking up that, uh, yeah, so that seems like a poor choice. Successful one, but poor choice. So, spade to the king, now I can lead a diamond up. And now have to lead a low club and still play for 9-8 doubleton. Uh, so, 2-no down 1 here. So, I did well passing 2-no trumps, didn't do the best in the play. Still think that one might be okay. Uh, some people might do worse. Some people might do better. I'm going 45% there. A harsh, but I think it's okay. 12, 15. One heart. And just rebid two hearts here. It's decent for two hearts, but um, okay, we're going four hearts. And. Might make a lot of tricks here. If hearts break 3-2, then I have probably six clubs, six hearts, and two spades. I want to preserve an entry to the north hand. Okay, they broke. And clubs broke, so that is all the tricks, plus three. 510. <laughs> Um, that one, I don't know, 53% seems very normal, didn't do anything there, um, but 
Maybe some people will do something strange. One diamond pass, pass. So here we've got 10, 13 highs. I could double and bid hearts. I could just bid hearts. I could bid hearts planning to reopen with a double. I could even look at bids like two hearts. But that will really put the spades on the shelf. So let's just start with one heart. Here is. All right. Four hearts it is. Queen of Spades lead, which is a doubleton or a singleton spade. Um, I got a deep spade loser that I need to trump. My partner's got 13 points opposite my 13, which is 26, so there are 14 missing. I could do something like pull a small club towards the king. And if West doesn't, if West hops up with the ace, I can't really throw anything away, but I might be able to throw my club loser away eventually if they duck it. So let's just pull a small club. If they ducked it, then I'd be able to play a heart to the ace diamond finesse. Um, am I going to play West for East for the king of hearts realistically? I don't think so. Um, so let's try and drop a singleton king of hearts offside. Okay, hearts were 2-2, two, two, and I've got all the tricks at this stage. So four hearts making. So it was a Dalton spade. East had literally... Oh, I was going to say nothing, but uh, they've actually got one point. They've got the Jack of Clubs. But uh, other than that, I think that was the best that we could do. Um, so pretty happy with 650. I guess no trumps is also decent. can probably make 11 tricks in no trumps. Diamond finesse, give up a heart. Three spades, two diamonds, five hearts. Maybe it's only 10 tricks, so... Uh, pretty good there. All in all, yeah. Uh, not, none of these boards are like really sticking out to me that I've done anything particularly well. Alright, so board number 5. Here we've got uh, 12, 13 points. I've got diamonds, I'll just pass. And they stop in two hearts. So for me, um, I just want to try and uh, draw trumps as soon as possible. Oh, wait, no. I don't want to do that. Dummies diamonds are terrible. Let's just rattle diamonds off at them. Uh, so the robots tend to lead king from ace-king, so I don't think that my partner's got the top club. So I'm just going to... All right. Do we have any spade tricks? So let's assume that my partner would lead king from ace king, in which case West has the king of clubs. Then I can always play a diamond later for trying to get a trump promotion, but I don't think I really need to. I'm going to play a spade. If my partner's got the king of spades, we can set something up like that. So I'll get in with the uh, ace here. Let's cash one spade. And do I have to give my partner a spade rough, or do I give them a trump promotion? Um, I'm going to give my partner a spade rough, because they played the 10. <laughs> ah, and the spade actually went. Someone... How did I miss a spade? Who... Okay, we got the king of hearts. How did the spades break? Oh, my partner pitched a spade on the uh, third round of diamonds, which I missed. Uh, so I could try giving my partner a trump promotion in spades or diamonds, and they couldn't over off uh, spades, so that was all well and good. Two hearts down two, I think, is a great result. Um, we got all of the tricks we're entitled to. Finally, a good score there. Board number six, 14 points, all in aces and kings. Let's upgrade this into a no trump. So my partner, Stamond, two hearts. 
Now we're in four hearts. Okay, so my partner has 13 points, so we'd be in four hearts regardless. I've got a club loser. I have two spade losers and a heart loser. If diamonds break, I can throw the club away from dummy. Um, so for me, it looks like win the king of clubs, cash the ace of hearts, diamond to the king, finesse a heart. Um, so I'll start with that, see, see where we get to after that. Queen of Diamonds, and okay, so at this stage I still have, um, I have two spade losers and a club loser at the moment, so I'll go ten of hearts, draw the trump, play a diamond over, okay, and I get to throw a club away, so I'll be able to rough my club, so I've got two spade losers, I just want to try and play them for one loser, so I'll play a spade towards the king. Okay, so here I'm just going to lose a two spades. Well, a spade. And we get to cross her off in the end. Even though they made my spade good. For plus 420. So, that one seems alright. Um, always got two spade losers, just have to... Like, someone might drop the double and queen of hearts, but other than that, I think I'm pretty happy with that one. Board number six. Seven. So racing through these, here we've got 10, 16 highs and a balanced hand, so one no trump. Heart lead. Okay, cool. So we've got five heart tricks and two diamonds is seven. So we can try playing for over tricks. Okay, let's just beat that just in case it was a 4 0 split. Alright. So my hearts are all good, but if West had led from a four card suit, then I had to let the eight hold. But as it was, I can overtake. Um, they potentially, like, I could cash out for seven, or I can try and build on spades. So let's just play another spade. Let's play a spade. And keep going with the spades. Might be tough for them to switch to a club from certain holdings. Okay, so now at the stage of throwing away winners, okay, and now I've got the uh, rest. So, might have been able to make more tricks. So, I had five hearts, two diamonds is seven, a spade is eight. So, if I wanted to guess the diamond position, I could have made more tricks, whereas I felt like just trying to sneak a trick through was a good idea, and West may not switch to clubs. They may choose to lead diamonds through. And when they do, then, like, if they didn't find the club switch, then it would have been alright. I was taking a risk that clubs were breaking, because if West won and then they cashed five rounds of clubs, I would have been worse off. So it was pretty risky. Maybe I should have just settled for my eight tricks after that, um, and with the potential of guessing diamonds. But I was greedy, but uh, luckily didn't get punished. And finally, board number eight. So here we've got 10, 12 points, one club, pop, one club, a heart, two clubs. I can make a takeout double here. Two diamonds. I'm going to compete the three diamonds. I don't think this is a game contract. It's just a part score hand. The opponents are doing a lot of bidding. And we got a diamond lead. So I've got three club losers, two spade losers. East has good hand, I guess. Um, 10, 12 points, opposite 8, so points 20, 20. Okay. And I want to try and rough two spades. I want to try and rough a club. I think I want to potentially set up the heart suit, so we'll go ace of hearts, rough a heart. So 
spade, spade, and trumpet, spade. Um, well, West had the fourth spade. I thought Ace was going to have the fourth spade here, and I was thinking I can lay Diamond and then Trumpet. Okay, so if I rough in with the jack, then that's bad. If I get over roughed, if I rough in the king, I don't get it. So let's just let them have this trick. Just, if West had three diamonds, they got their trick. Oh, uh, yeah. So I couldn't stop them having that. I could have roughed low on the spade. That was another potential option. So uh, three diamonds making three. I could have made ten tricks here. I'm not feeling confident on this free day long tour. I think I... 53, 54% maybe. Um, a little bit sloppy from time to time. But uh, we'll see the provisional results. And then um, if you want to join the friendship group that compares this, add me as a friend in BBO. Slink2, S-L-I-Y-N-K-2. This is just for the free day-long tournaments. Let me know that you've added me, and I'll add you back. Um, tell me your BBO username. But uh, let's check out the provisional results. 50.55%. So I only got 16% for one no. Um, how would have hearts gone? So I guess hearts does make more tricks. So hearts loses um, a diamond trick. A spade and two hearts, so no wonder that one was bad. Forgot to think about uh, how hearts would have played. Usually consider that, uh, which means playing for spades is definitely worthwhile. Or like my play is decent, trying to sneak another spade through, hoping they don't switch to clubs. Or I could have hoped to have guessed the diamond spot. Uh, then four hearts on the nose, just 41%. That many people were dropping the double and queen, I'm surprised about that. And then two hearts when we beat it too. We got 30% for that one. I thought I'd done well there. Like I was really happy with that one. That seems like a harsh 30%. All the others are pretty decent. I uh, Probably more generous than I thought they'd be. Um, like misplaying two no trumps getting 76%. Did well passing that one I guess. And 67% for three clubs when potentially I could have passed it in. But uh, yeah that was the free day long tournament. And we'll check out how everyone else did. So the results are in, and I finished with 50.34% in 5,589th. But let's see who in our friendship group did well. So, drumroll please. Stuart TW, 80%, finished in 15th. Gray M, 76%, uh, finished in uh, 48th. Sean, 9816, 157th. Akameni, uh, 227th. PGS, 58th in 864th. Bendy uh, with 800, sorry, 897th, and P Majora in 930th. So well done to all of you. Nice top 1,000 finish. Um, so overall pretty good. A couple of really nice finishes there. Um, so thanks all for joining in for the uh, free day-long tournament and joining this group. Uh, if you want to join, add me as a friend, Slink2, and post in the comments that you've done it, and I'll add you back. Quick review of the hands, and uh, three clubs down one. Uh, a handful of people passed it, and some people even managed to make. So, uh, what did I miss here? So, Diamond lead and Ace of Clubs club. They then switched to the Queen of Hearts, and then another Diamond exiting to East. Went ace of spades, spade, uh, which set up the spades to discard the heart. So this is a decent line of play, just ace of clubs club. You know that there are roughs incoming and no convenient way to get to dummy. So I think that's entirely reasonable. I should have given more thought to that. Uh, some people passed two hearts doubled. And yeah, it is cold, so very dangerous there. Lots of people letting that make a lot. So 67%, I'll take it for misplaying a hand. 
two no down once, 75%. Some people passed it in. Some people bid and made three no, but a lot of people going down a lot in three no Trump. 53%. I think I guess this one spot on. Um, nice simple one. Then uh, four hearts plus one for 59%. Again, reasonably simple one. That was pretty generous there. Then two hearts down two was 30%. So what were people doing? So some people were getting to three no trumps because they... Oh, they doubled. Oh, I do not like that at all. Uh, people that doubled get to three no trumps. One no trump is something that uh, I would have considered but is a gross overbid. Um, so I don't like any of them. But uh, yeah, two hearts down two. Um, I was content. I thought it would have been better than that, but uh, just the 30% for me. Then uh, four hearts by South, and just making without dropping the double from Queen. A lot of people were making it. 87.5% for making plus one. So club lead, jack of hearts, the ace, diamond up, ten of hearts. The... Don't know why they chose not to take a uh, finesse and also lead. Jack of hearts to the ace, ten of hearts to the, jack of hearts to the king, ten of hearts to the ace, such that if east had queen eight fourth, they now had two heart losers. Um, but maybe they thought that north couldn't see. So if you're playing from the other way up, uh, east might cover with the queen of hearts, but not very often, I wouldn't think. Um, when they've got like queen third heart, uh, they need that to cover their playing their partner for the. Nine of hearts, I guess. Not unreasonable. It's something to work on if you're playing it the other way up, which I didn't think about. Then one no plus one, sixteen percent. Lots of people, even four hearts. Wow. So you got the uh, two clubs and a spade to lose, but I was surprised that they got to four hearts. So, like, if you're thinking, like, uh, one heart, two hearts, just bashing four hearts. Work today, but uh, not my style at all. And then we finish it off with three diamonds. I feel like I, I could have made another trick here, I'm fairly sure. Uh, someone made, a couple of people uh, made plus 130, and that scored them quite a lot. Um, so if I went back to my original thought that East only had a Dalton diamond, then I should have uh, made another trick, a uh, Singleton diamond, sorry. I should have Ace of Hearts. Like, I know. You, there's no diamonds lower than that, so when I got to this point here, I could just rough in the spade low rather than with the ace of diamonds and would have got an extra trick. So, missed an opportunity there. Anyway, that was the free day long tournament. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.